sure we're coming in live. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> nice. Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another live stream. Today, today is July 4th, 2023. And happy Independence Day to those of you in the United States of America, USA. We had Canada Day on July 1st. And um, I hope you're having a fantastic week, actually. Uh, what day is it today? Today's Tuesday. Okay, and it's 1 p.m. PST um, Pacific West Coast my time and uh, Today we're just gonna chill. We're gonna enjoy uh, Sort of a top-down view of looking at some Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! trading cards that I ended up buying um, From an auction local auction that was going on. I don't I didn't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh! Finnish dude How are you doing? Hope you're doing well welcome welcome to another live stream uh mr prinks is here right on you know your usual cards awesome i was hoping you're gonna pop in uh we're gonna go through them uh we're gonna crack open these fake packs and see what's there emersonic good evening good evening chicho and chad good evening emersonic hope you're doing well instant notification right on right on right on right on <laughs> base man oh yes awesome awesome Mr. Big Haha, of course, I'm watching this. <laughs> nice. And by the way, I, I've gone through the binder, just quick flip throughs a couple of more times. And there were some uh, real, I believe, first edition cards in here as well um, and whatnot. So um, it, it, all in all, <laughs> I don't know if, if we paid too much or not, but it's been a pleasure having these. So I've been really enjoying just having this and I'm looking really looking forward to um, doing this live stream and I actually uh, I went and uh, opened up one of the boxes that I have of cards and I have these you know these things for cards and stuff and maybe uh, we'll go through some of the other boxes I looked in there and I got some trading cards soccer trading cards from uh, the World Cup from 1994 I don't think they're 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 worth anything I don't think not too many people collect soccer or football trading cards uh, but there are some other stuff and i found some dune cards in there uh real quick a look i took and there's baseball cards hockey cards and whatnot uh, marvel cards and whatnot so uh it's got me looking into cards again uh, i wasn't a huge comic uh card collector uh it's just leftover stuff that's just found their way to us right so super fun super fun uh, <laughs> finished dude um i'm doing okay vacation started on sunday how about you nice my vacation started on friday i'm gonna take july off and it's vacation for me i just work all the time so for me it's just not teaching and just taking care of the rest of the business that needs to be taken care of so looking forward to it looking forward to a start of the weekend off pretty pretty heavy duty uh, had a party on Friday night, had a all night party on Saturday night, <laughs> two parties on Saturday, afternoon party and stuff. So I'm sort of in a recoup mode as well. Uh, so it was fun. It was fun. Uh, good living Brett salutations. Hope you're doing well. Hi Chicho. First time watching the stream live. Good to be here. Glad to have you. Uh, good living Brett. Salute with uh, coffee. fun i'd say mr prince i'd say when uh, going through the binder separate the dark magicians and blue eye eyes white dragons from the rest as they are definitely worth something awesome i th that's one of the reasons i brought these guys I, i'm hoping to just to separate the reels from the fake and then the mm, stuff that's worth something from the stuff that's not you guys have to tell me what they are i don't know this i don't know this but first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna crack open these these packs. If that's uh, it's up to you guys actually. Do you guys want to crack open these fake packs first, or do you guys want to go through the binder? You guys let me know. Okay. And for those of you that want to know what this is all about, um, I sort of ended up buying an auction here. Let me link up. This is uh, what you're seeing there, and I'll link it up in the description of this video once we load it on our video sharing platforms. This is the video where. You know, I was, we were doing a patio live stream, and I sort of said, "Oh, I bought Yu-Gi-Oh cards," and people were like, "Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh, 
<laughs> I'm like, okay. Didn't realize your tree was so huge. So I brought it, uh, brought the the stuff out and started showing them. So that's the that's the video uh, where we sort of flip, show you what I bought. Uh, today we're gonna go through it in uh, detail, I guess. Right, base man. Been a few years since I used my Yu-Gi-Oh deck. The Dual Masters cars car game is lots of fun for duels on the go. Just got a deck of the Lord of the Rings Magic the Gathering cars. Pretty cool, but they are overhyped and overpriced. Are they overpriced? <laughs> and overhyped, of course. Lord of the Rings, right? Uh, what else could it be? Uncharted Ace. How are you doing? Ghostface salutations. Making some beats today. Nice. Hope everyone is doing well. Indeed, indeed. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, Mr. Pinks, I got the Sauron deck. I'm enjoying the Lord of the Rings cards, but yeah, some of them are very expensive. Uh, like, But aren't you just buying them in packs and then cracking them open in packs and seeing what you got? Or are people chasing the cards already? Well, it sounds like people are chasing the cards already. Someone mentioned that one of the cards was selling for what? It couldn't have been am i remembering right two million or something <laughs> like that's crazy is that like the justin bieber buying the what do you call it the monkey um nft card for 1.5 million and it's now worth i don't know if if it's even worth that uh you know forty five thousand or something like this uh based on i have the 11 council commander deck it comes with a full deck ready to go i'm a noob at magic cool Man, it makes me want to get into this thing. But I don't want to get into it because it's too addictive. Mr. Pinks, they have packs and four already made decks that you can upgrade. Okay, okay. And then they're going to be releasing like the, what do you call the booster packs and stuff, right? <laughs> I don't think I'm going to get into it. Initially, I got all hyped. I was like, yeah, I'm going to get this. But yeah, I, I'm doing a comic book haul online right now. So I'm spending some money on that direction. Uh, fun stuff, fun stuff. Gang, oh, I'm going to do intro. Speedy Gonzalez, gang. Uh, we're on Patreon, Substack, Subscribe Star. We're live streaming on Twitch. We announce on Twitter, Minds, VK, Gap, Getter, and Substack Notes. Uh, live streams we do have a soundcloud page for podcasts i'm gonna get on that more um hopefully this summer okay um we're gonna upload this full video on sensor to pitch shoot rumble and odyssey and we have a guild server you're definitely welcome to join us there and gang for all of you that are supporting this work on these and other means these platforms and other means thank you very much for the support gang it is as always in large part because of your support that we're able to do this elder god chicho i actually used to collect world cup trading cards nice i completed 1986 collection nice and about 75 percent 1982 1990 collection nice i have the holograph cars from 94 i think they're the 94 uh world cup i, I looked at it i was like what is this i had to f do this i went oh yeah they're holograph uh oh the trading cards for the 94 world cup they're fun i i, I think i have uh, the one i looked at i had it was uh, the german one uh mateos it was the, i'm pretty sure it was mateos uh, that i looked at and i said okay i gotta come and do the yugio trading cards i can't get lost in the in the box of cars that i just stumbled on right uh sven how are you doing i'm going to be 30 this year nice yugio was a big thing when i was a kid i used to have cars too wow 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 huge lots of people there eh? There are some good cars you can buy. Uh, Mr. Pinks, there are some good cars you can buy to upgrade that deck and make it much stronger. Some good videos on cheap upgrades for it. But if you're new, then you'll have a lot of fun with the deck anyway. Cool, cool, cool. Gang, I'm going to turn these off. What we're going to do is we're going to keep the chat going because you guys know about this and I don't. Okay. <laughs> So usually for comic book readings, the chat's popping up here. I turn off the chat and the notifications, but we're going to keep the chat on and the notifications going and uh, and see what information uh, people can share. Lothar, Maceo. Is it Lothar? 
uh, no, uh, midfield Matthäus. Was it Luther, Luther, Luther Matthäus? In the midfield, he was phenomenal. He was one of my favorite players of all time. In the in the back midfield, he would just go down and feed everyone. And he had the, some of the craziest powerful shots. So good, so good. Yeah, yeah, Germany. Yeah, 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 Germany. Phenomenal player. Really like Matthäus. Really like Matthäus. And what a, what a respectful player. He was such a respectful player. Really. Uh, but gang, what do you guys want to do? You want to crack open these decks, Speedy Gonzalez style, see what they are. Or go through the binder what do you guys feel like doing I'm okay either way because <laughs> <It's Yu -Gi -Oh. laughs> what should we do <laughs> let me change up the change up the angle I shall wait until you guys tell me what you guys want to do these are the cards the these guys like there's four different colors I think right should we crack these open or go through the deck I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm all excited. <laughs> Time is like, okay, come on, come on. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> I'm like, uh, whenever I plan on playing board games with anyone or any type of game, um, I get all excited. I'm anxious to play. Uh, Sven, your call, boss. Go for it. Uh, Mr. Pinks, you could do the booster box first. I think it's a fake, though, but it could be fun still. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Fake me. <laughs> <laughs> let's do the box let's do the box okay i'm gonna change the angle again let me do this <laughs> okay so let's put the binder away let's crack these open let's see what this is all about okay so let's put this over here so this is the box right and i bought this uh, the uh the binder and this box with all the packs and stuff it came out to around 100 15 120 Canadian 100, 110 to 120 Canadian okay so that comes out to around I don't know like 90 bucks US or something right so this is the box and it guaranteed it's got to be fake right uh, if it's real I'm manhandling it <laughs> which I don't think it's real and it's got a whole bunch of cards in here okay I'm gonna crack these open see what they're up they're about okay looking fake Cheech that is 100% fake. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Phoenix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. 100% fake. Let's go with fake. Based <laughs> on looking for Chicho. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Jalen, hey, Chicho, dude, you got to jump on Pokemon card. Uh, I got a, I, I found, I, I found a handful of Pokemon cards in the box that I looked at, but they're, I don't know what they are. Uh, Sven, why it reminds me of snacks. Okay, well, let's, let's crack open the green ones. So there's four different colors, yellow, blue, red, green. And we'll go through the Speedy Gonzales. Okay. I wonder if I should bring, no, it's okay. We'll do this. So. <laughs> Good thing I brought scissors. <laughs> Hard to crack open. Look at this. Maybe it's this way. Nope. Okay, we're gonna cut them. We're gonna cut them. Joe Bucky. Yeah, these are definitely fake. Komani. Oh, look at that. Oh, they got little dents in them or something. So let's throw these over here. There can be only one. Right. Serious glare on him. <laughs> Cigar more dumbbells. Easy. <laughs> so let's go through these. Let's see. Uh, there can only be one. This one. They got a nice, uh, nice artwork on them. Glary. Check it out. Maybe I should have put the kit. Ha uh ha. -huh. 
yeah they definitely fake but at least you'll get a taste on opening some packs it's fun to see the hollows you get nice man these things must have been going for mint uh, if they put in this much effort to generate the fakes right some kind of mega dragon look at that I think packs in the background are messing up oh maybe yeah 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 yeah. let's move it up let's move these away good idea yeah doink doink yeah because they do have a glare let me put these guys here we'll grab them one at a time and if we get sick and tired of cracking these open then uh we'll go through the binder it's just we got a skylight above here so it's like one thing with these fake cards is, is it looks like a lot of these things are um, like they're supposed to be like super powerful dudes that's one pack oh there's another one here what's this guy some kind of Jurassic spinal but someone mentioned uh, previously that uh, people still use these decks the fake cards to play with are hard to focus on nice artwork though salut chicho at the side what are you doing hey these pokemon cards were huge like two years ago seems like no one talks about them anymore really I think they just got people got priced out of those things yeah seems like usual usual community is supposed to be huge did not know it until uh, oh here's another dino one Celestial Wolf. So these are all so far all the green packs. looks like the top one is always the halo one and the holographic ones and the all the holographic ones seem to have those two lines see if you can see them see those the glare catches them huh? well, maybe that's because it's just the top one this is one of the ones you were talking about uh, mr. pinks no
these are AI generated I don't think so there must be they can't be too recent these ones are they yeah it is you have a real dark magician in the binder okay cool here let's put the we'll put the dark magician on the side so when we get the real one we do a comparison that'll be cool check it out even on the back you see those two lines glare there so all the hollows seem to have that glare the top one in the decks it's so anime so manga trap card These are like attack 2000, defense 2000. They're all like crazy powerful. Just gonna make them fake, might as well make them powerful, I guess. Is that what the deal is with this? So those are the four green packs. Okay. Let's do orange. Cut it off totally. So these guys shouldn't be any similarity with the other guys. Because they're a different pack, I guess. Super hippo. Try opening them without scissors. It's easier to tell if they were resealed. It's really hard to open them, Mr. Brain Freeze. With here, I'll try the next one. I'll try to open it up. Like it's, it was really hard opening them without. Like it wasn't cracking. Hey, we got one of these in the in the binder. I know this one we have. Blue eyes, white dragon. We know. I know we got a real one of these in the binder. Here, we'll put this one on the side too. Why not? Blue eyes, white dragon. If you have three, you become Kebu. That looks pretty real, but it's not. Yeah. Good quality fake. <laughs> Star Grail Warrior. What I'll do, I'll keep the different color ones here. I'm gonna put the green for green pack here. I'm gonna put orange for the orange ones here see for these ones it was really hard opening them that's an easy way of opening these wait it's not even opening that's why I'm using scissors either that or I need to eat more meat Seriously, that's crazy. 
Oh, there we go. Oh, I was going the wrong way. So how do you know if it's been resealed? If uh... So I need to go this way, not that way. Okay, cool. It's like a bag of chips or something. That looks like a little nun. Null nun. Oh, this one's flipped. Okay, we flip it. That's cool. Really cool artwork. Red dragon. I can't, but I, I don't think these are the smell of solvent, maybe. I read somewhere that the cards, you do this. God. <laughs> A screenshot. <laughs> oh, funny. Oh, there's another one here. Under it. Pull it like this, like this, like this. There we go. Nice. Oh, look at this one. Not even cut properly. Take a look at that. Oh, cheap fake. Cheap ass fake. Haha. <laughs> These other ones were cut nicely. These other ones, take a look. Right? <laughs> Ronnie, what <laughs> for you guys? Gladiator beast. These are the fake ones, Ronnie. We're cracking open fake packs and going through them. Okay. Nice artwork. You still have all your cars from the early 2000s. Nice. I think there's one of these in the binder as well. Okay, this is last of the red. <laughs> there we go. Maybe you're supposed to cut it from the black. track with the 
扫地。You got five, Ronnie says you got five exodia. Okay, those are the red ones. And then we got blue pack. Let's go with the black. Oh yeah, way easier to open this one. Cool. Eleven blue eyes from SDK. Ronnie's like, no, oh, that's for real. Mr. Pigs, that's an insane amount of worth. Take a look at this one. Cool. Very cool. Art. Oh, that's nice artwork. First of the dragons. That looks great. I think there's one of these in the deck as in the binder as well. White dragon. Oh, which one was this one? Oops, this was a blue one. I got a so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. So these are the blue ones. I'm gonna put them under the blue guys. Boink. one we're cutting We saw one of these. We saw one of these guys too. Cool. No, we saw one of those already. That one's new. I don't think we saw one of these. Oh, and here's another one. Blue eyes, white dragon. Doink. Okay, this is the last of the blue ones. Another one, Dark Magician. Is that the same? Yep. Yep. Oops. Yeah, let's blow this one. 
close to this guy. Oh yeah, we saw one of these. Jin Shikan. Uh, these are the packs that we're going through that are the fake packs right now. So we're going through them Speedy Gonzalez before we get to a binder. Open up. Green, red, blue. And we're about to crack open yellows. Okay. Pink, like not much. The binder is going to be where the big ones are nice. Ronnie's like, I got 1500 cards. Wow, good investment! Good investment. Cool. Oh, we haven't seen this one. That looks cool. That's super cool. So these ones are the yellows. Yellow. Let me put them over here. Green, blue, yellow, and red. Just like conflict, man. Haha, -ha, indeed. And by the way, gang, just so, just a math something. It, you need four colors to be able to separate countries based on their color. So same color is not touching uh, on a map, global map, right? Mathematically. But the proof for this took a long time to be shown mathematically algebraically okay um and when finally someone was able to do it they won like a pretty heavy duty uh sum of money for uh, for showing that proof which is super cool which is super cool Mr. Pinks. I wish I had some of the early 2000 ones. The nostalgia you get looking at them, especially Lob and the old old starter decks would be insane. Oh, look at this one. Elder screenshot. Oh, that's Sal. That's a pr that's beautiful artwork. Fake or not, that's beautiful artwork. That's Sal. <laughs> That's Sal going crazy. There's definitely one of these in the in the deck as in the binder as well. I'm gonna put this one on the side. <laughs> Sal's trying to get in here. Hilarious. Oh, there's one more here. Oh, and there's another Dark Magician one. We got two more of these guys to go through. Then we hit the binder. This one was easy to crack open. Thank you very much for the follow good living brit oh look at this one oh she's riding a dragon beautiful artwork oh 
we, this is the first time we've seen this one. I don't remember seeing this one. Oh, there's another Jurassic one. We saw these ones already. I don't think we saw this one before. Cool. Cool. And this is the last of the fake pack. Let's crack it. That probably took a lot of work tr creating these fake uh, fake cards. Oh, this is another dark magician. That's the third one we've seen of these, I think. That's it. So these were the how many packs? I don't know how many packs we had there, right? So, let's do the binder. Let's bring out the binder, gang. Let's bring out the binder. So there was a whole bunch of cards in this, right? There's sheets in this. Fake, bake, completed. Yeah, but there, uh, there are fake ones in this as well. Okay, there are fake ones in this as well. Let me show you these ones. I took, I put these ones in, in uh, these thingamajiggies, in these guys. Okay, the plastic. Two of these seem to be real, and the other four are fake. And you can tell, pretty much, from the back, if anything. First of all, the name, right? There's two of them that say, Kona, uh, Konami, and the other ones say, Konta, Konta right and then the color of these ones is darker than these ones okay and these are chinese i guess right so these are definitely on the fake i'm assuming right mr pink so there are some fake ones in the binder but it's just cars from the packs you just open yeah uh no 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 there are definitely fake ones in the binder the the fake ones here that we opened up up top here those are we know they're definitely fake but there are some fake ones here in there are more of them further down into the binder okay um but there are definitely some real ones i don't know what the percentage of real to fake is Right? Saudi avoid oak. Con the fake Kanta Chinese cards are to summon Mao the Forbidden One. <laughs> Hilarious. And then these ones. Like were there real Chinese? There must have been. So are these the real ones? Or a different quality fake one? Hawk, thank you very much for the follow. If you touch them, they are real, hilarious, awesome, Hawk. <laughs> they're, they're all real. They're all real. Right? So would these two be real? Because they don't have, whoops, they don't have anything written in the bottom here, right? Uh, Mr. Pink's, uh, oh, Mr. Pink's asking, I meant the person you bought them uh, from open some of the packs you had and put them in there as they are from the same set. But over 90% of that binder looks real. Oh, really? 90%? That's cool. Yeah, they must have. They must have started buying packs, uh, fake ones, and putting it in a binder. So these are the six Chinese ones I got, or seven? 
seven Chinese ones I got, uh, five being fake, and the other two I have no idea about. Uh, someone might know who's either here or watching the video later on. Okay, I'm gonna put these ones in the bag. And then there's this instruction. This is based on another game. It's like a hex game for Jujio. Huh? And gang, do not forget, do not forget. Free Assange, Free Assange, Free Assange. Julian Assange is a publisher and journalist that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity. For more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org, or countless resources available online. So check this out. Let's go through these. So you guys let me know. This this one is for real. The blue eyes white dragon, right? And then compare this to the fake one here. Right here, let's pull them out. So this is the fake one we just opened up. This is, I believe, the real one. So real, fake? Is that what we're going with? And I'll show you the back on these as well. And the real one, and they're not the best quality, right? Krupp Z. Real on the left, 100% base mass says. Nice. And you can see the color on the real one versus the color on the fake one, right? Jeez, man, I thought... Uh, that the crucifixion of inmates was a thing of the ancient world they brought it back they brought it back yeah sleeve the blue eyes and dark magician ones they they are real okay cool okay so i'm going to keep this one here so we're going to put this one in these yeah Doink. should we put it in one of these guys too <laughs> i got these things which are hard should we slip it in there as well? I don't know. I don't know. Actually, the coloring can be off between two real ones. Oh, they can be off between two real ones. Really? Okay. Uh, you remind me of the collection I had two two decades ago. Nice. Slip it in, baby. Slip it in. <laughs> yep. Slip it in. Let's slip it in. <laughs> Let's slip them in. There we go. Oh, is it going to fit in? Yeah, there it goes. Nice. These are like tight getting in there. You can read that any which way you want. Should we slip it in there? It's definitely hard getting it in there. Or should we just slip it in without the sleeve in it? Tight, eh? <laughs> yeah, Jimmy should try it. Hold on, let me do this. Because the white is uh, is a text, uh, people's things coming in. I have the same issue. Aha, Elder God. Funny, funny, funny. Where's Cheryl to put everyone in their place? Raw nugget. Let's check it out. Raw? Raw in. Pink cube? Raw in? Nah. Keep it in the sleeve still. Keep it in the sleeve. Okay, Mr. Pink's knows where it's, where it's at. Let's put it in the sleeve. Let's put it in there. Good enough. 
And what I'm going to do is this, how's the text coming out on this? Can you guys still read the, yeah, you can still read. Boop. Okay, we got this guy in there. And then the Dark Magician, this one too, eh? Let me take all these guys out. I don't like the binder being here. It's a pain in the rear end. Let's close this. Let's get rid of the binder. Okay. So we got this guy in there. What you do with that, you can put it in there and hit the bottom of the table. Yeah, I don't want to hit the bottom too hard because the mic is set up here. So it'll be super loud. And let's take the Dark Magician out too. Check this out. There's this Dark Magician is different than this Dark Magician. All right. Boink. What's the power on this one? Uh, check it out. Now it's totally dark. There it is. Attack is 3,000. Defense is 2,500. And these guys up here, is that what you mean with the power? Boink. Ah, 4th of July picnic. Some of these uh, are some OG cars by the look of their nice. They are, but they are reprint of the OG as they aren't first prints. Doop. There's a couple of first prints that I need to, we'll look at them. So what we'll do, we'll go sheet at a time and you guys tell me which ones we should sleeve. Whoop. Dark Magician, get in there. There we go. So that Dark Magician's in there. Any other cards from here that we should sleeve? Book of Secrets. Ended Pegasus? Where is the Ended Pegasus? Is there Ended Pegasus? Thousand eyes restrict. So I'm assuming nothing else from this. I don't know how much these are. Uh, I'm assuming Ronnie stuff must be worth like ton, thousands. Sleeve the two middle ones. Okay. Doink. And then we'll put these guys away. Oh, look at this. This one's like. So these are the two two middle guys. What are they? Soul Exchange, and the Flute of Summons, Summoning Dragon. Right. Baseman Chicho. We're talking about the TV show. Oh, TV show. yu gi -Oh beats Pegasus and his tomb cards with the Magician of Black Chaos. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. Ronnie, not sure how much they're worth, but I got some cards uh, that came with video games too. Cool. Which are pretty rare. I'm just going to put these ones in sleep. I won't put them in the rookie card. Okay. Thank you, Baseman, for filling me in. Okay, what about these guys? Let's check it out. There's some fakes here, too. Most of these might be fakes. Maybe. White Knight. Let's take a closer look at this. Great White. Oh, 
ultimate offspring. The shark one, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this one looks like carnage. What's the difference between your blue eyes white dragon and the one that sold for eighty five thousand? Uh, blue eyes white dragon. This one, one of these sold for eighty five thousand. First of all, it's not a first edition. This one is not a first edition. It's a reprint. And this one is not in mint condition. So the fakes, so um, Mr. Pink's, so the fakes you can see right now are ones you pulled from the packs uh, earlier. Yeah. So check this out. Because the text on the fakes is darker. So this one would be a fake. I mean, we had one of these, some of these pop up. This real, 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 um, real. This one says first edition. Is it real? Maybe. Here, let's check this one out. Check this one out. Is that going to be real or fake? No, this one would be fake too. Um, so check it out. This one's fake as well. It's too dark, the text. So this one's fake as well. Hey, come back. So this one looks like all the all the sheets are fake. Except for that one and that one. The shark and the top three. Okay. So this one we're not gonna do anything with. Let's check this one out. Okay, these ones there's gonna be uh this one looks real this one is real first edition this one i believe is real too this one is most likely real as well here i'm gonna pull these guys out that's fake you're already approach each other ah, thanks mr pinks check this one out this one i think is real All right. cyber falcon real or fake They are real. Cool. And this one's not bad condition. Right? So the top three of these actually this whole page is first edition. Here, I'll put them back in here and we'll look through them. You guys tell me if any of these need to be sleeved or pulled out of the here. So check this out. All of these seem to be first editions, right? And real. Let me see if I can focus on this thing. Okay. Cool. Shadow of Eyes. Track card gust. Could sleeve the morphing jar. Morphing jar. Where is the morphing jar? This one. Okay, we'll sleeve this one. Morphing jar. Thanks, Mr. Pinks. Biomage. Soul of Purity. Oh, this one might be fake. Yeah, I think this one is fake. 
possible. Oh, well, maybe not. I don't know. We'll look at it, we'll look at it from the back as well. Driving snow. Let's look at it from the back. No, I think it should be pr probably real. Yeah, it would be real. So let's draw, let's leave the morphing jar. Morphing jar number two. That whole page is looking very real. Yeah, yeah. So that's good, cool. And they were all first editions, so that's not bad. I don't know if they're worth anything, but hey, cool. I'll put them in, in these guys later. And these ones look to be all first editions as well. They look... Oh, check this out. Check this out. Dark Hile. Dark hole. <laughs> dark hole. Where's the dark hole? Oh, a dark hole. This has got scratches on it. Silly person, whoever did it. Check this one out. Here's a reprint of this. Let's keep them in order. Check this out. And this is the first edition. Uh, this would be time consuming, but in the future, if you, you're you not sure of the value of some of them, you can. Uh, you can the code you see in the right side under the picture this one cool and they will show online cool nice will do check this out so first edition uh later edition i guess right and so that's a real one first edition And then this one. They have the same date on them, 1996. This just has happens to have the first edition on it. All right? Cool. Let's throw this back where it was. I'm a purist. Put it back where, where you found it. <laughs> so let's take a look at these ones. Now you guys let me know what should be sleeved or not. I always do that. Uh, I'm addicted to buying them off eBay. Ah, oh, Mr. Pinks, you buy these things off eBay. Expensive hobby, expensive hobby. Okay, let's see if we can focus this thing. There we go. Baseman, if you look at the six code on the bottom left of the picture, it indicates which deck or pack it came from oh bottom in the bottom left so we're talking let's see there's a code there hold on let me see if i can bring yeah this is like two there it is there it is let's see if we can focus there it is. because it's in this there you go that's the code It's actually eight eight numbers. Bottom right. Oh, bottom right. Okay. <laughs> oh, that one. Bottom right of the picture. That one there. Okay. SDP zero dash zero four six. So the code on this one would be different. Let's see. Let's see what this one says. Oh yeah, look at that. SDY-050. That's very cool. That's very cool. SDY-050. That's a reprint. And this one is SD5 
zero four six was it let's see yeah no sdp zero four six very cool very cool very cool very cool oh 50th card in the deck is that what it means oh that's cool So some of these are from the original starter decks back in the day you were right. Cool, cool, cool. This one's zero four five. So it's the 45th car from MRL. Sleeve that Toon Skull. The Toon Skull, okay. The Toon Skull. Summon Skull. Look at this one. Is there a marking to see how rare they are? Pink QB? I don't know. Look at this one. Dark Hole. Why do people write on? collectible stuff I don't understand cool red archery girl hey you can you can still use it in a duel make a morph malevolent muzzle yeah maybe sleeve these or keep them in the page uh, massive shame about the dark hole and that's a classic is it a classic yeah too bad why would someone do that where's the skull one Toon Skull. Which one was it? Sleeve the Toon Skull. Oh, Toon Skull. Oh, this one. Sleeve this one. Okay, we sleeve this one. Oh, this is already sleeved. Check this out. <laughs> Someone's already sleeved this. Yeah, I'll take the megaphone out. Someone's already sleeved this. Here, we'll keep it here megaphone megaphone where is the megaphone here's a megaphone let's take out the megaphone now this one is worth a lot megaphone here we'll take a closer look at it check it out oh come on focus there we go megaphone magic card yeah i think it's a hollow too Oh yeah, sleeve that one. Sleeve it, okay. And then here's the back. Um, I didn't catch the name. Thank you very much for the follow. Cool, megaphone. In you go, in the sleeve. Here, let's put it in like this. Here's the kicker with these. These were well played, which I'm, it's like used comic books. I don't mind having used comic books in my collection that are low grade because they were well read. And it's, it's pretty cool having well read comics. Yeah, we'll throw this one in this. Cool. <laughs> I'm 
And then this tune one. You know what? The tune one, let's put it in one of our sleeves. That way you can see the back too. Here, we'll put a tune one in one of these two. Washing, 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 washing time mirror. Can I take a look at all the blue eyed white dragons? Blue eyed white dragons. We have one here. I'll show you. I'll show you the real one. There are fake ones here. was tighter on these ones because that's not the rookie one that's different here I'll show you the the blue-eyed white dragon let me just get this going on this there we go easier to get in Here's the blue-eyed, uh, blue-eyed white dragon. This one, but it's not a first print. I think there's a first print in uh, in the in these bind in these pages, though. Yeah, I do have uh, at least one more coming up. Uh, it looks like Toon summon skull sells for. A hundred plus. Wow. Toon Summer Skull. This is the Toon Summer Skull. The number is MRL073. Let's see if that's the same number we got here. But that's got to be in really good condition, right? Oh, let's see if we'll focus. Oh, this is the. Is this the Toon Skull? Yeah, Toon Summer Skull is SDP021. So it's a different one, pink QB. So I, would, I don't know what the difference would be. Okay, we're moving on from this. So dark hole, look at this one. They got trashed. We shouldn't bother sleeving the dark hole hole because it's like trashed. I don't think first edition, but it's so damaged. <laughs> This summon skull is from the starter deck for Pegasus. Okay. Oh, that tune summon skull isn't worth much, according to Google. I'm Googling them. Are you Googling them? Pink Kiwi Cool. Awesome. <laughs> this way, yeah, that one is an, is an ultra rare one. The SDP is a common. Ah, okay. Okay. Big. I never had a desire to draw on my cards as a kid what the hell <laughs> seriously why would anyone draw on their card so these ones look to be real as well right that guy looks awesome what's his name the hunter with seven weapons cubist knight Skull servant kicking myself base base man kicking myself for all the juju cars that I trashed or lost along the way many years ago. Oh no. This skull is not uh, very powerful. Skull servant is a classic. Skull servant. Is it is this a classic? This guy? looks pretty weak like it's got a what is it attack of 300 and defense of 200 you need a horde of these sleeve this one serious okay we sleeve it so it's the collectability part is not necessarily the price how powerful the card is but we'll definitely sleeve that one for sure what's this one dark's deal You can use crush card uh, virus with that. First edition. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. 
Baby dragon. I like this baby dragon. Dark fire soldier. Rogue doll. Yeah, power doesn't matter too much most of the time. All about the effect on the deck it is in. Ah, really? Very cool. Very cool. Dark assassin. And then what's this guy? Dark Titan of Terror. The Skull Servant deck is uh, very good for classic Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu okay. So from this, we're just going to sleeve this one. Dark Servant. Skull, Skull Servant, not Dark Servant. Skull Servant. We'll take a close look at it. Skull Servant. Zombie. What does that say? A skeletal ghost that isn't strong but but can mean trouble in large numbers haha <laughs> so it's a horde horde of skulls cool let's sleeve this one so I'm assuming that's the only one we sleeve from this deck from this page Boink. let's see how hard it is to get into this one. Oh, this one's pretty easy nice that was easy Boink. What about this little baby dragon? I like this dude. <laughs> it's not a sleepable dragon. Sorry, baby dragon, you're out. Can I see the bottom left card again? The bottom left, this one? This one is a hollow, I believe. Here, let me bring it out. Super cool artwork. Look at that. X, how are you doing? Hope you're doing well. A long time. I remember the baby dragon from the show was so many years ago. I watched. <laughs> that one is fake. This one is fake? Really? Oh, is this so? I don't know. Also, lettering is off. I knew it, Mr. Pinks. 100% sure. 100% sure this one's fake, eh? Oh, cool. Let's see the color. Oh, yeah, look. The the real ones, The that's one of the things I've been using. Yeah, that's not hollow if, if it's real. So, is this hollow? so is it let's check it out yeah take a look see let me pull this out one one way I've been doing trying to figure out what's fake and real is the the real ones are darker surround on the back of the card the fake ones are lighter Shiny art means hollow. Okay. Check the back of the album page first. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they did a great job with that fake card. They may uh, have used the real cards back, really. Cool. Okay, so this one is fake. But cool, but cool. Haha, <laughs> don't judge a card by his color. Awesome, awesome. Let's check out these ones. Oh, that's a huge difference in color of the back. Yeah, yeah, X. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're doing our favorite music. So these ones. So all of these seem to be fake, except the middle guy. Possibly. So check this one out. 
So we're doing music lyrics tomorrow, gang, if you're into it. Censored music. So check this out. So the lettering is just too thick, right? This one, I don't know. The lettering on the text seems to be small enough. Destiny Hero. Which one's Destiny Hero? Oh, it's this one. This one might be real. Because the text on it is... Uh, But the it's light on the back so my guess would be it's fake but i'm not 100 sure top middle is real so this one is real cool this one is fake Okay, cool. That one is real. This one fake. Whoop. This guy I believe it's real. What up on? Right? On Charger Days. I know nothing about UGO, but finding this incredibly lesson for Tuesday evening awesome. <laughs> fake. Right? Fake. This one fake as well. So these two real. Okay. And they're pretty good shape, these ones. You're getting good. Oh, thanks, Ronnie. <laughs> these ones. They all seem to be real. I think this whole page is real. So NA cards are a lot lighter than EU cards, even though both have real cards. So it's hard to tell with color sometimes. Ah, okay, good to know, good to know. Uh, not sure about Swift Gadget. Check that one again, Swift Gadget, Swift Gadget. Which one was Swift Gadget? Where's Swift Gaja? <laughs> Gaia. Oh, Gaja. Gaia. Swift Gaia. Wait a second. There is no Swift Gaia. Is there a Gaia? Basement. That page you are holding is real. But can we make sure about... Oh, Swift Gaia is over here. bottom bottom row okay hold on which one are we talking about bottom left oh there it is swift guy at jeebus yeah i'm pretty sure this one's fake thank you thank you guys fake Oh X, I bought the, I bought these while we're here. Yeah, it's looking off. Yeah, I think so. X, uh, I bought these at an auction, a local auction place, uh, and I just wanted to get get them. They just look cool to me. Uh, so I bought everything uh, with the fake, with the packs. Uh, everything came out to around 120 bucks Canadian. So all of these seem real. Tuck and mask. The destiny hero one. Okay, hold on. We're going back to this one. The destiny hero. So sleeve this one. Okay, we sleeve this one. Yeah, I think this one is real. The text seems to be good. Ah, okay, cool. Fake or not, they look great. Yeah, they look fantastic. Really liking these. I will sleeve yummy card. Yummy card. Okay, that must be on the other one. Let's bring this up. Let's see if this will fit. Okay. Hey. Okay. 
yummy yummy there's the yummy okay let's take a look so we looked at that one tuck and mask let's take a look at this one rain of mercy plants yummy okay we'll sleep the yummy card and it's a reprint it's not a first edition We got a gamble. Type zero magic crusher. Haha, <laughs> that looks super cool. Chain energy. Protector of the throne. Randall, how are you doing? Finally catching a stream after a rough few months with lots of work. Ah, welcome back, Randall. Glad to have you. Missed you, missed you, missed you. You as well, Randall. I hope you get a nice break. Call of the mummy. and Yumi chain energy chain energy where's the chain energy? there's a chain energy is that hollow here we're gonna sleeve the yummy three three weeks vacay uh vacay now whoop whoop awesome so we'll, we'll sleeve the yummy card okay and then should we look at this one you guys want to look at this one the chain energy to see if it's hollow i hope you got fun things planned or just relaxing time randall for three weeks oh this one's tight why is this tight can't tell it might not be sorry yeah i don't know if it's a hollow but we'll take a look at it it doesn't look shiny to me Let's sleeve the yummy card you know what i think it's the sleeve that's too tight let's grab a different one Boink. Maybe. Huh. Super tight. Okay, we'll leave it like this. We take care of this later. Let's take a look at this one. Chain energy. No, I don't think it's a hollow. Yeah, music lyrics gang. If you know music lyrics, if you like music lyrics, come tomorrow, 1 p.m. We're gonna do music lyrics. And we're specifically focused on censored. Either censored artists, censored lyrics, censored something. Let's take a look at these. Uh, real, 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 fake, real, real, real. Any first editions? Only the fake one is a first edition. Looks like it. Okay, that wasn't. Look at this dragon. Wing dragon. The dragon card is OG, is this one? <laughs> awesome. Gang, do not forget, do not forget. Free Assange, free Assange, free Assange. 
Julian Assange, the publisher and journalist that has been crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capital's power to humanity. For more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org. This one fake, or countless resources available online. Baseman, 20 years goes by real quick, indeed, indeed. This one, Ancient Elf. The Furious Seeking. Cyber Falcon. Let's take a look at this falcon, it looks cool. Skull Knight 2. Nice. So nothing sleevable here. No. You throw it away. Not throw it away, put it aside. <laughs> we don't want to throw it away, we want to keep it. These ones, these ones. Oh, here's another one of these ones. Tune summoned. We sleep one. Interesting. I can't tell if it's fake or real. Oh, wow. Rendell went through my Magic the Gathering cards yesterday. Checked value and sleep. Nice. Fun. Big boy, mm. cool seeing some of the cards. I remember from 20 years ago. Yeah, the nature of the lyrics. I got I got a couple of couple of sorted out. This one's cool. Gravekeeper. Oh, the two summer cars are real. They're common. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Drill bug. If we find a um, hollow tune summer skull, then you have value. Okay. Poison money. Here's the Toon Summer Skull. Summon Skull. Ceremoni Ceremonial Bell. What does this guy look like? Wow, oh, look at that. Tied it up. Let's see if we can get it to focus. Whoa, look at that. That looks trippy. That's beautiful. Kotodama. Steel Scorpion. Okay. We flip. We go to the next one. <laughs> we got a lot to go through. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> Look at this. Shadow ghoul. That's a ton of cards. A ton of cards. <laughs> I'm assuming it was a good deal. One. What's this one? It's 
Sky Dragon gain justice. This one is fake. Let's check it out. Uh, so fake, this one, real, real, fake, 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 real, real. Okay. So these are fake. We'll just flip through these. Speedy Gonzalez. Just because of the text. We know because of the text. The text is too dark. Too thick. The font. Sky Dragon fake. Yeah, this one fake. This one fake. Yeah. Foggy. Foggy. I don't know what the foggy is. <laughs> this one fake, but these look these these two are real. I think the Bistro Butcher Grizzly might be real. Grizzly might be real. Okay, we'll take a look at it. Yeah, the Grizzly is real. I think this one is real. Mother Grizzly Bistro Butcher is real. Cool. Yeah, these two are real. So we're getting good at uh, picking them. Cool. cool 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 so we had four real ones in this one and five fake ones damn that butcher looks like a outlast character giant axe mummy this one's real. I believe so anyway. Forced requisition. What's this one called? Inspection. What's he inspecting? Looks like a tax collector or something. This one is fake. This one fake. I think. Okay, I don't know about this one. This one might be real. Force Requisition was a great card to play. Was that cool, cool, cool? Cold Wave. Deep. Darkness Approaches. Darkness Approaches. This one is fake. See the text so different. This looks like a fat birdie. Oh, here's this dragon again. these things is not like the other fake real real beat up <laughs> monster recovery real. lizard that's an iconic card which one the forced uh, requisition right 
Lots of dragons. Armored lizard. Cool. Look at that. So many of these ones. I'm assuming this is common. <laughs> if we got three of them. I'm assuming they're common. Okay, we'll take a further view look instead of looking at them. Unless you guys want to take a closer look at a card. Because we have a fair bit of pages to go through. Okay. So all the top three seem real. The two on the left, on the right, real. This one fake. And the bottom three real. Oop. Crawling dragon. If there's one you want to take a closer look at, let me know. Okay. He put this one in the sleeve. I wonder why I put this one in the sleeve. Or the person put this one in the sleeve. The magic recovery. 20 minute warning. Oh my. Boop. Let's see. We might go a little bit over. But we'll take a look at them three at a time. If there's any cards you guys want to take a look at. Overtime expected. <laughs> overtime expected. If there's any you guys want to take a look at, let me know. Okay. Real, real middle guy fake would be quick guess. Two right ones real, this guy fake. Bottom three. The middle guy is real, and I'm assuming these two guys might be fake, but I can't be sure 100%. Maybe. Take the sleeve card out the binder. It's a good good card. Okay, I will. Actually, this looks real. This looks real. That's real. And this one looks real. Okay. So sleeve card, this one. Let's take this one out too. Monster recovery. Whoop. Let's take a look. Fake, fake. And the rest look real. Oh, here's another uh, blue eye white dragon. That's the fake one. So we know this one is real, but it's not a first edition. Oh, this isn't the first edition either. So we should take this one out too, I guess. This one seems... See this. Check it out. Maybe we leave this one in the deck. Yeah, the blue eye blue eyes is good. Is it good? Okay, let's take this one out then. It's pretty beat up though. Look at that. <laughs> Someone trashed this thing. <laughs> let's put it in this door anyway. Someone got serious good use out of this. 
leave the change of hearts too they are good even in today's game change of hearts oh both of them really okay cool and they're both real Boing. and they both have the same uh, number card 32 sdy 032 let's sleep both of these Oh, still a little rough condition, but still blue eyes. Okay, sounds good. Hey, come on. Okay, come on. Boink. There we go. I heard change of hearts got banned, then unbanned. Really? They banned the card? Why would they ban a card? Summon Skull. Oh, there was a ghoul summon skull we took out wasn't there oh yeah look toon oh toon sum summer skull versus summer skull summon skull interesting mr pinks yeah it was banned for years ah but today's meta is very strong so it's not considered broke now really so they banned it because it was uh it had a it made a glitch in the game that's cool oh there's another gaia card is that the same gaia we gaia the fierce knight i think we did a different gaia card Man, you lose track of these things. No, I can't find it. Oh, the other one's Swift Gaia. Thank you very much, Ronnie. <laughs> okay. So let's take a look at these. These ones, fake, 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 fake. Real, 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 real. Okay. Best guess. Tuchikosi. Tuchikosi. Track master. This one looks hollow. This one looks hollow as well. Middle row left and right are fake. Yeah, these guys fake. Like just the text on them. The heavier text is is a sh just a giveaway. Right? And then the lighter text on these ones. No, I think they're fake. I think they're fake, Ronnie. Look at that. I think they're fake. They are fake, yeah, right. The font is thick, the font is thick. These ones, uh, these ones all look real. These ones. Yeah. Let me know if any of these need to be taken out. Let's take a look at these ones. Fake, fake. These two are fake. The rest of these should be real, but there's no first editions.
this one. Look at this. Trashed. Trashed. So many hours of playtime has this card seen, right? Sort Stalker. Look at that. Mean. Let's take a look at these. Fake. Oh, there's another dark hole here. Wait a second, is that the same type of dark hole as the other one? That was written on? Did we take it out? Oh yeah, take a look. Dark hole. Oh, this one is a first edition. This one is not. Take a look. The first edition is trashed. And the later one is not. Why is there no 19 sync display in the lower right corner of some cards? Fake ones won't show up. Yeah. Sleeve soul exchange and dark hole. Soul exchange. Where's soul exchange? There's soul exchange. So check check this out. Let me show you guys this as well. Uh, <laughs> someone decided to trash the first edition dark hole. Look at that. What the what the F? They trashed it, right? But then the reprint one is not trashed. Right? Okay. I'll 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 sleeve this one as well, and then the soul exchange. Oh, there's two of them. He put two of them together. Cool. And these seem to be hollow. Look at that. So some of these have two cards in them. Look at that. Soulish Kings is awesome. Nice. Baseball. You'll probably find a lot of dark holes. <laughs> the holographic version is more rare. Okay. Let me just see if this pen works on this card. Yeah, basically. Me. So, okay. We'll, here, we'll sleeve these guys. Let me do a quick sleeve job on these. Boink. Hey, come in. dark hole must have must have been a pretty good pen <laughs> soul exchange dark hole so these ones boop. they all look real okay Let's go to the next one. Here's another one of those guys, the malevolent muzzle. There's two of them. And these ones, um, these are all, they all seem real. Okay. They all seem real. These ones top and bottom row fake the middle row seems to be real legit okay so top row fake middle row seems to be real bottom row fake I really don't know what the difference is between the colors I'm assuming there's like different elements or something these ones they all seem to be real 
Uh, no first edition stuff. You think the top is real? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The top is real. The blue threw me off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The top is real. Good catch, Mr. Pinks. Good catch. Look at that. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, compare this text. For some reason, it, the text seemed thicker for me to this text. Right? Look at that. Big difference. Giant gem. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's real, too. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stop running to conclusions about what's real and what's not. Giant gem. Nice. You're catching these super fast. These ones all seem to be real. Sleep the hungry burger. Hungry burger. Where's the hungry burger? Was a hungry burger in the other one? Oh, there's a hungry burger. Hungry burger. <laughs> Look at this. It's a hungry burger. <laughs> That's great art. Oh, wow. Look at that. Hungry burger. Chop, chop. Awesome. That's a great card. Look at that. Nice. Hungry burger. OG burger card is a big awesome. Share the pain. Electric lizard. It got new support in a recent booster box, so it's worth a couple of couple of pounds. Nice. Hungry Burger. So some of these cars go up in value based on the boosters that are being released that work with these cars in the game, yeah? That's interesting. It's like comic book industry. They bring back like they or they renew like a C or D rated character and all of a sudden it shoots up in price. They give them like extra powers. Very cool, very cool. All of these ones seem real. Fusion Gate. Yeah, so very old cars that came out early 2000s still get support to this day as the decks are loved. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, there's another dark hole. Okay, we got a lot of dark holes. And again, not a first edition. Should we keep this one in the deck? We'll keep this one in the... Or should we take it out? I don't know. If we got three of them. S spike protein. Bottom monks. Is that what we're... Sleeve... Toon blue eyes. Toon blue eyes. Tune blue eyes, sleep tune blue eyes, okay. And then protein, spike protein. Is there a spike protein in this one? Defense. Oh, there's spike bot? Spike, spike protein bot, Monkas. Time wizard is a classic time wizard. Which one's a time wizard? Time wizard. It must be in the other. Oh, there's a time wizard in the other one. Spike bot. Oh, I was just making a joke. <laughs> I 
I don't get it, but I'm laughing. <laughs> Chicho, you're building a deck, uh, or just looking for valuable cards. I, I I'm not. I, I don't plan on build, uh, playing Yuju. Not unless I get a serious opportunity. I don't know anyone that would that that would play. <laughs> Multi millionaire, yes. <laughs> Enjoy I am, thank you. Enjoy I am. But I think we're just pulling out uh, what's valuable and what's not. Sleeve, uh, Magician of Faith, and Time Wizard. Okay, Time Wizard. Yeah, we're just pulling out what seems to be a uh, little bit of value to the cards. And what's important. So sleeve these two guys. Okay, let's sleeve these two guys. And they're real, not first print stuff. And I don't know how many how many cards do you need when you put a deck together. If that's the case, we're building a deck. <laughs> if that's all it takes. <laughs> Let's check this one out. Soul release. Um, yeah, all of these look real. And no first editions. About 60. 50 to 60, I think, is a, is a deck, okay. I might have to buy more uh, booster <laughs> more booster packs or <laughs> more auctions. Keto Diet Master. Keto Diet Master. Giant Soldier of Stone. Don Quito, the Cure Master. Should we sleeve that one? I don't know. He, he looks like he needs to go on a diet though. <laughs> oh, it's not a diet master. That's me actually. You probably have enough to make a pretty solid deck. Do I? Awesome, awesome. That's good. Fantastic. I need to read the rules of this game. Oh, here's another Dean Kito, the Cure Master. Okay, so these ones for sure, fake, fake. So two fakes here. Okay. The rest seem to be real. No first editions. Teen. Was it in the other one? Sleeve. Teen World. Last page, Teen World. Toon World. Toon World. Sleeve Toon World. Not Teen World. Toon World. Toon World. Let's take a look at it. Oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful artwork. The cars explain most of it. Cool. Baseball, you need to world to to go with uh, tune summon skull and tune world to go with tune summon skull and tune blue eyes oh okay yeah 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 play together that's how you put a deck together they work together ah first time chat Emmanuel Goff and I summon pot of greed which allows me to draw again haha <laughs> I'm assuming that's one of the cards. People are gonna jump on that if it's a part of the game. White magical hat. <laughs> Mr. Pink knows what it's all about. Awesome. This is like a whole genre. Oh my god. As a kid, the most popular game was Marvel. <laughs> all we needed was a was a blue in the ground and a good set of marbles, yeah. This is an extension of Marvels, I guess, in a big way. I don't know anything about UG Go. I, I don't either. <laughs> Summon Skull again. Cool. Let's check these ones out. Fake. So one fake in this one. No first editions. 
Camel Baron Summon Skull. Summon Skull. We got a couple of these so far. The Summon Skulls. Evil to Hope. How are you doing? How choo choo? I like your collections. Thank you. Mad Sword Beast. Frenzy Panda. Sparks. Fake and the other two are real. This one, the art looks crazy cool. Look at that. Whoop. Seriously, beautiful artwork, eh? Beautiful artwork. Let's check this one out. So fake, fake, the rest are real. What flavor are the cards? These are Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, <laughs> Yu <laughs> cards. Sorry, I should have asked you to sleep the summon skulls. Oh, really? Okay, I'll go back and sleep the summon skulls. Afterwards, go back and sleeve them as I think you have a few. Yeah, yeah, there was uh, at least a couple that I remember. At least a couple. Check out these ones. I like these fishes. Look at that. Three of these guys. All of these are real. No first editions. Seven colored fish. Do you have the three phantom god cards? Ah, uh, is that the. Oh, this page is all water type. Ah, that's cool. There's a theme going on with it. So fake, fake, fake. These three are fake. The rest are real. Should be anywhere. This this guy was the Earth guy, yeah. This guy was the Earth guy, yeah, yeah. I'm starting to get a really good feel for these things, right? Water type, Earth. The color, I don't understand why the colors are different of the cards. There's that Carnage dude again. <laughs> I love you Mo. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Camille Barons. How do you know what is fake? Sorry if this is no, it's not a dumb question. That's one of the first things I was asking as well. Check this out. The first giveaway is this is fake, this is not. The text color is thick. Okay. The text color is thick. That's major giveaway. Major giveaway. I love you more. You're like my 12 year old self. Oh my god. Just had a vision of the American psycho business card scene. Awesome. Except with Yu Gi Oh trading cards. He used embossed white, off white. The American psycho is awesome. This one fake and the rest seem real. No first editions. Oh, the color of the cards are this. Oh, base man, you rock. So pink is trap cards, green is spell. Nice. Blue is ritual monsters. 
Very cool. Purple is fusion cards. That's bone. Oh, bone. That's right. Light brown is a regular monster. Very cool. Very cool. Dark brown is an effect effect monster. So when people are putting decks together, they you definitely have a mix of these cards. There isn't anybody like that's playing with a deck that's just all like purple. Right? Family Barons love playing you playing the UGO games on PC. Shame I never got to own any of the physical cards. Oh no, physical is where it's at. Physical is where it's at. I love this karate man dude. I love you more. Chicho, tell me dad real quick what the Canadian life of growing weed <laughs> you will trip. Washington there. There are also cards of God attributes. Cool. Oh look at Chicho. Look at that subtle coloring. The tasteful thickness. <laughs> That's a quote from American Cycle. His face creases in horror. Oh my god. It even has a watermark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. So all of these are real, these ones. Canadian lifestyle depends depends take a look at these ones fake fake and the rest are real Zebra, Boar Soldier. Well, besides the Canadian bacon, but you get it, haha. Uh -huh. Cool. Take a look at these fake, and the rest seem real. Three Harper brothers, Harpies, Harpies brothers. The Harpy cards. <laughs> if they comment, they must be. There's three of them right there. I'll be trying for Mo. All the same. Mo. The Harpy sister sisters were a thing back in the day. Were they? These guys, sleeve sa saga, sleeve this guy. Okay, thank you very much, Mr. Pink. Let's sleeve this guy. We've got a lot of sleeves going on here. Very cool. Very, there, Bakun cards. Bakun, Bakun. Let's check a look at Harpy, the artwork on the Harpy. Oh, look at that. That looks great. Harpy sisters, Harpy brothers. Is there a dark magician? Black magic double. In the next page, let's check it out. Oh, yeah. First edition. Is that real? I don't know. I think that might be fake. 
We had a Dark Magician here, I think. There we got a Dark Magician here. Yeah, I think it's fake. Yeah, it's got to be fake. The text on it is darker. Check it out. Here, let's see. Fake-wise on these, this whole page looks to be fake. Ah, take care. I got 12. Packed. Here, we'll take a look. What's such a cool card? Wow trick me take here we'll take it out watch this for sure it's got to be fake here's the difference take it out right the real one the text is italic and lighter color this one is darker and look at the the code in the bottom is different and it says first edition but i'm assuming maybe the first edition was like that yeah the border gives it away the border gives it away cool <laughs> it's nice seeing the fake ones versus the uh code is also an indication cool 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 no mr pink says first edition dark magician <laughs> It's a fake. Also the stars. Ah, okay, okay. Let's check it out. Do you think they make the fake cards obviously fake on purpose? I don't know. I think in printing, it's harder to make really fine uh, designators. Fake. It, yeah, I think this whole page is fake. I think it's really hard doing printing of very fine text, right? I think it just costs a lot of money. Fluffy Burb, did you buy those fake cards for the stream? No, no, I bought a, I don't know anything really about Yu-Gi-Oh uh, cards. And I bought these uh, at an auction. I bought all of these in an auction. It came with a binder plus a whole bunch of cards fake and this and we cracked open a lot of packs fake packs and these binders were in it so i just I'm, I'm a collector so that's what i ended up doing for these ones all of these seem fake and this one is real red eyes b dragon is real wait red eyes yeah this one looks real gang i'll pull it out but check it out is red eyes important let's check it out let's check it out oh red eyes haven't seen that card in a long time pull out the bottom left okay we'll do <laughs> mr brings late sleep 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 so these ones are fake red eyes uh, dragon is so cool Ooh, god attribute card right there sleep that okay we'll do so these are these ones here's the here's the thing right the this one is the fake that one pretty sure is real and it's not first print right oh it's the first card sdj first card sleeve this baby okay and it's in pretty good shape well no it's got a crease there but here i'll show you guys that's real that's got to be worth 50 grand <laughs> sold <laughs> pink QB. <laughs> send me the send me the e-transfer <laughs> red eyes magician and the blue eyes white dragon are the three classic cars belong to the three main protagonists in the show really cool here we'll put a sleeve put this in a sleeve Boink. here we'll put it in this right away So no refunds. <laughs> Baseman says. <laughs> nice. Cool. 
Let's take a look at these ones. Oh yeah, these ones we already looked at. These are all fake. You, you remind me trying to show my younger brother. These ones, these are all fake. These are all fake. These are all fake. So towards the end of the binder, we're getting more fakes, right? Yeah. These all look fake. There's a blue eyes again, fake, fake blue eyes. These ones, oh, this is the last page. This is the only fake one. And the rest look real. Uh, no first editions. Yeah, yeah, basement, they all look really fake. I'm just looking at the back of these two and they look fake. Wow, that last page is a little hard to tell unless uh, this beer is getting to me now. <laughs> yeah, these all look real. Take a look. This one looks powerful. Wing, wing weaver, wing weaver. Do you collect any other uh, TCGs like uh, Magic, Pokemon? I, I have some Magic. I have some Pokemon. Very little Pokemon. Very small uh, Magic. Lambrent wall, portrait, the portrait secret. That looks cool. And then that's it very cool so this is what we ended up pulling out check it out so we pulled out one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five and i think there's a couple of um uh, couple of uh summon skull in here as well so it's going to be 27 lambreth wall lambreth wall should we sleeve that one as well lambreth wall camel baron baroness camel baroness lambreth wall so we've got 27 we pulled out fun times fun times high defense for lambreth wall high defense for lambreth wall let's check it out Oh yeah, 3,000 defense, but it's pretty beat up. It's not an exciting card. It's just good on the defense. Okay, okay. 3,000 defense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty good. Gang, I'm going to bring back my view. Doosh. Fun. <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. That was crazy awesome that's super cool man 27 ten dollars would they be ten dollars pink cube i don't know i spent total including the fake cards everything whatnot uh whatever 120 dollars so uh that will hold off a blue eyes oh i will hold off a blue eyes should we pull it out let's pull out a lambrinth to mr pinks keep the blue eyes red eyes and dark magician separate as they are worth the most keep them in a hard back too okay so keep the uh red eyes let's see dark dark magician red eyes uh bah, 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 bah. 
blue eyes, blue eyes, blue eyes. Uh, so, no, not summon skull. Well, some red eyes, summon skull, and dark magicians are my favorite. Uh, Baby Knight says, uh, from the sleeve ones. This stream was so nostalgic. Loved it. Awesome, awesome. I'll look at. I'll look at this. These guys. Where's Mr. Pink's <laughs> the blue eyes? Uh, blue eyes, uh, red eyes, and dark midges are separate. Okay, we'll do. I put them there, and I think we have a couple here that I'll put. Uh, I'll put there as well. Kind of want to watch the show again. Ha huh? <laughs> ha. Use use them three cards as a thumbnail too. Oh, use them as a thumbnail. Okay, hold on. Let's do this. Oh. Can't wait a second. Can we do it this way? <laughs> wait a second. Rookie card, rookie card. Here, let's do this. We'll see if we can grab a good thumbnail. Oh, it's not gonna work. I would have to take scans of them. Doing rookie card. Maybe I can grab it from here. much color on these guys <laughs> okay i will i will i'll figure something out i'll figure something out thank you very much mr pinks yujiro rated on youtube is pretty good is it cool 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 gang that was awesome thank you very much uh for the help for participating in this for for going through this uh together uh that was super fun super fun nice break from the chaos chaos of 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 in, of everything right uh super fun super fun um i'll pull up the summon skulls out of these and sleeve them and keep these sleeves uh separate and uh, maybe i'll look up more info on these uh in the future and see uh, see what it is maybe after loading them up on uh, our video sharing platforms on these ones sensor to pitch uh, rumble and odyssey I'm pretty sure it might get comments and people might say certain things so we'll see uh how the heck has two and a half hours just gone by yeah crazy flies by turnover chess hello chicho hello turnover chess mr pink's very fun chicho i always love looking at the old classics it's nice to see the nostalgia people have for it brilliant stream it, 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 thank you guys man super fun super fun yeah turn over chest we're done we did two and a half hours great stream very fun with everyone indeed indeed gang if you're into music lyrics tomorrow 1 p.m same time we started today we're doing uh sharing our favorite music lyrics specifically focused on censorship okay so either censored artists or censored lyrics censored something themes uh and we'll you know you can share the lyrics that you love and we'll read them all i've pulled one out i'll see if i might pull out a second one as well i usually pull out two and read them and uh we'll see where it goes we'll see where it goes aside from that gang uh, just as a closing we're on patreon substack subscribe star uh we do announce uh we're live streaming on twitch hopefully to be right live streaming on kick and rumble soon um, we do one also on Twitter, MindsVK, Gab, get, um, Getter, and uh, Substack Notes. We do have some podcasts available. I'm coming. <laughs> what are you, Elder God? You're going to get us <laughs> nuked. <laughs> and you're definitely welcome to join us on our Gilded server. Gang, everybody, thank you very much for joining us on this stream super super fun super fun i'm on the hunt uh, i'm buying stuff again so we'll see uh, what we end up uh, adding to our collection and we'll go through them aside from that gang i hope you have a fantastic evening fantastic morning and uh, i will avoid the word though awesome elder god awesome and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow and the next day on on uh, wednesday on thursday as well we're doing our map stream have a good one, guys. Yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Bye, everyone.